More details in the twisted case of two missing kids with Valley ties. New surveillance video shows seven-year-old J.J. Vallow a few days before he disappeared. The children's mother, Lori Vallow, is in jail tonight and still has not revealed where J.J. and Tylee are. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Mitch Carr. And I'm Rachel Cole. Team 12's Michael Doudna has been following this complex story from the very beginning. Michael, what else can you tell us about the brief video? Yeah, guys, it's a ring doorbell which shows seven-year-old J.J. running into his mother's town home in Idaho just days before he disappeared. It's another twist on a story that involves a drive-by shooting, three deaths, and a mysterious set of disappearances. Now, the video is from September 17th, after the family moved to Idaho from Chandler. Now, months later, we still do not know where J.J. or his sister Tylee are, as their mother, Lori Vallow, sits in jail tonight in Hawaii, held on a $5 million bond while she awaits extradition back to Idaho. Now, we got in touch with Idaho's former attorney general on why Vallow's bond will remain so high since right now all she's charged with is facing charges for deserting her children, lying to police, trying to get others to lie to, and contempt of court. Five million dollar bond is very atypical in any kind of criminal case. It would typically arise only in the most serious of criminal charges or in the alternative where it is immediately likely that the defendant would flee the jurisdiction. And that's what they're really worried about here. Now, an extradition hearing is scheduled for Monday, March 2nd, which is next Monday. Guys, back over to you. All right, thanks a lot, Michael, for those details. Our coverage on this disturbing case is far from over. You can find a timeline of when those kids went missing and everything that's happened up to this point on the 12 News app.